so whenever you are speaking of i right when you are speaking of i i has two components what is the component changing, changing and unchanging correct changing part is related to your body mind intellect your role your society is changing part correct unchanging part is related to what consciousness consciousness correct huh? understand what is the nature of consciousness anadi anadi ananta ananta sanatana sanatana brahma brahma sachidananda sachidananda anadi anadi ananta ananta sanatana sanatana brahma brahma shivoham 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 that is the nature of consciousness right so when you sit silently thoughts will come so you in the thoughts you drop what is not what is changing then unchanging thought is shiva shiva ho unchanging part right go to the unchanging part and if the mind still comes to the body remember anadi ananta sanatana brahma sakshi shiva shiva ho the mind becomes silent and you are shiva swarupi again if thought comes reject thoughts which are changing part which is changing what is unchanging part hold on shiva akhanda ananta anadi sanatana brahma shiva is it simple or complicated very simple very simple very complicated theory No, very simple. Very simple. See, please understand. Whatever I am telling you, highest and highest of spirituality made it so simple for you. Okay. This is what Shiva taught. This is what Shiva taught. This is what Dakshinamurthi taught. Taught. Okay. That teaching I am giving it to you in a way so simple and so straightforward that you can apply it in your life. Okay. So let us take. Okay. First, this is Atma. now we have to address the world first we'll address the world because our mind is directed outwards right so what is world actually world matter world is it's not there's nothing about matter actually matter is appearance consciousness so world okay what is this banana banana is a name and banana is a form okay what is this apple. apple is a name yes. apple is a form the name and form changes okay but existence of apple or existence of banana doesn't change that existence is shiva okay so the wall exists the chair exists the table exists i exist just focus on existence aspect existence any thought comes just go back to existence oh my lovely friend immediately add she exists i exist all is existence oh my strong enemy exists i exist all are existence okay in the outer world go to the existence part of the outer world and existence is god that doesn't change form changes okay what happens is this banana i eat where is the banana now banana exists as digested in me then banana exists as blood in me banana exists in bone in me when i die the banana exists as fertilizer existence never changes Are you ready? Mm-hmm. That never changing aspect is what you have to focus on in the world, mm-hmm. and that is Brahman. That is consciousness, that is Shiva. Now, where does the existence begin and where does the existence end? No For existence is infinite. Yeah. Okay, yeah. this chair exists here. That chair exists there. Between them, there is a gap, right? 
So is there a gap in existence? Because between them there is space. Space exists. Existence is Akhanda. Means there is no parts in that. Ananta. Anadi. Beginningless. Sanatana. Timeless. Brahma. Shivoham. So now we have to think. Just hold the thought. I am existence. I am existence, right? Do you exist? There is a question in that, doubt in that? I am exist. The world exists. Everything exists. The name and form keeps on changing, which is Maya. I hold on to God, which is existence. I am existence. Then the moment I am existence, I am infinite. Are you clear? Huh? So for this, you have to hold your attention here. Sasra. Everybody is getting vibration sasra. Anybody is not getting vibration sasra. Please raise your hand. Huh? You are not getting? Getting. You are getting or not getting? You are getting here? I did. I did. Did you do this? Uh, all of you? No. No. First, let me open up your sasra. Okay. Let me convert banana. Banana into existence. Vibration. <laughs> As if some... Hmm. Okay. Whenever I communicate with others, whenever I talk to the other, I always think of them to be a shell only and I'm addressing the... This is thinking. From thinking it has to move to feeling. From feeling it has to move to reality. Hmm. Thinking there's a gap. Still. It's okay, beginning. Right? Thinking about happens, I keep thinking that it's happened to that. No, no, what I'm saying is that is a thinking is fine, but thinking is not the end. From thinking it has to become feeling, from feeling it has to become reality. That's the relation. Okay? Now take a chair here. Sit. One, one small chair here. Chair, chair. chair. Bring that, bring that. <coughs> so, our breath is moving from here to here. In the spinal cord, it's moving from base of the spine to sas adna. Okay. So the movement is taking place. All the chakras. The chakras are Muladhara, Swadhisthana, Manipura, Anahata, Vishuddha, Adna. So these represent, Muladhara represents earth, earth, Manipura, uh, Swadhisthana represents water, Manipura represents fire, Anahata represents air, Swadhisthana represents uh, space and Adna represents intellect, intellect manas, mind. So now what is happening is that I told you spinal cord breathing, right? The, the attention is shifting from the earth to Adna. Okay? That bad is told you know, spinal cord breathing. Right? You are withdrawing the attention from the gross to subtle. There the Sakshi is there. Consciousness is reflected. Chidavasa. Okay? In waking state, in deep sleep state, it's here. I have told you heart center meditation also. That deep sleep state, all pervading Shiva, who is everywhere, for the purpose of experience, he takes the form of Jiva. Okay? As Jiva, in the waking state, he will stay here and spread throughout the body. In dream state, Okay, in deep sleep state, he will sit here and withdraw consciousness from all part of the body. Okay, that's why first I told you this meditation. Now I am telling this. Okay, this is actually, this is the place where Kutastha or Atma, Brahma in our body. Okay, so we will take the energy which is mind and energy to that place. Hmm? 
So one by one you can comment it. It's too hard. <laughs> so, just take breath as if you are breathing from breathing from here to here. Okay, and I put my hand there, and when you start feeling the vibration. So that is actually Sahasrava Chakra getting open. So the energy, consciousness are on the, on the Jiva moves back to Shiva in your body at that place. Just become aware of this place. You can feel the vibration here. So, remember Shivoham in the breath and reach that place and observe. <coughs> you it? Okay, sit. Practice this. Mm. So let the breath move from head to mm. belly. Oh. And just head feel my hand, right? Mm. Shivoham, associated with Shivoham. Mm. And feel a subtle vibration in the head on top of the head. Deep breaths from that point of breath. Deep breath. Mm -hmm. With the shivoham. So 